I got your six. You can count on my guns. I'm talking about my arms here. Boots off the ground. This is gonna be so fun! I mean, I'm ready! One last mission. Let's make it count. Welcome, Mr. Reed. You are finally ready to undertake your final test before field deployment. Do not be nervous. You are more than ready. Is what we would say if you had actually listened to the brief that clearly stated, do not bring your weapon. That was a joke. Please, take a moment to review your settings in the options menu. Then, proceed towards the examination room when ready. The goal of every mission is to acquire the package and extract with it, preferably alive. The package will always be hidden in a secure vault. To access it, you will need to open the vault doors by disabling vault terminals. This is the insertion phase. You will then infiltrate the vault. This is the infiltration phase. Hack the terminal to acquire the package. Then, you will need to extract. This is the extraction phase. Hack an extraction terminal to call an extraction vehicle. Once the vehicle arrives, make sure you are in the extraction zone and wait until the extraction gauge is filled. Now, let us proceed with the practical test. Smile. You are now on the screen. The holographic cover is the most important tool an agent has at their disposal. Without it, anyone looking in your direction can easily identify you. Please, stay put while your cover activates. Think of the holographic cover as a shield protecting you both visually and physically. While active, nobody can see your actions, weapons, or gadgets, only your movement. Additionally, it absorbs some of the damage caused by incoming attacks. Try moving around the room while paying attention to the screen to see how your cover reacts. Notice that your cover only follows the direction you are moving towards. It leaves you free to look around without being suspicious. The holographic cover does have some weaknesses. Firing your weapon will instantly blow your cover. Try it for yourself and see what happens. When the cover is blown, it will need some time to recharge. Standing still makes this process go faster. Moving slows it down. Beware, there are other ways to blow your cover. It can also be broken by taking damage, different gadgets, or agent abilities. The holographic cover is just a tool. It's up to you to use it optimally and to be aware of the dangers. The insertion phase will now start. During your missions, you will encounter various locked security doors. To open them, you will need intel. Gather intel by hacking the devices around this room. Different devices yield different amounts of intel. Three intel acquired. You can now open the security door. Staff level doors lead to a staff room. To blend in, you will need a staff cover. To change your cover, walk up to a staff worker and interact with them.
hope no one hollers at me. Always make sure to have the proper cover when entering a security room. Move along. In this room, you will need to open a guard level security door. Five intel are required to do so. Chop chop. I feel so good! Hey, I'm good. You will need a security guard cover moving forward. Find one in the previous room. have the same suit. When you are ready to continue, take the gadget on the desk. This is a bouncing mat. Inflate it to bounce others away, block doorways, or make yourself jump really high. Boing boing. Use the primary action button to deploy the bouncing mat. Use the secondary action button to inflate or deflate it. If you leave a gadget behind, you can recycle it. Hold the reload button while the gadget is selected. After a short cooldown, it will be usable again. Security doors can also be opened by using a matching key card. There is one hidden in this room. Find it. To help you in your search, you can activate your expertise. Key cards will unlock any matching security doors at no intel cost. Shut down the vault terminal to open the vault door. Three vault terminals once the field upgrades provide you with different improvements to your arsenal, making them very valuable. Use the navigation mode to easily locate the object. While in the navigation mode, use the primary action button to select a highlighted object. While in the navigation mode, use the navigation mode will then show you the fastest path leading to it. Use it to locate vault, objective, and extraction terminals, in addition to health stations and ammo dispensers. Now, where would security guards go? Heads up, Mr. Reed. You are not alone. Two agents are currently in the area. Pay attention.
Just remember where you place it. Good spot. Yeah. Objective should be close by. Don't screw this up. agents. Keep in mind that intel will be drained when you use it. Make good use of this powerful ability. A downside to holding the package is that your position will be pinged to everyone at intervals. Pay attention to the objective gauge at the bottom of your screen. It gradually builds on its own, but the faster you move, the faster it builds. Enough talk. Now let's activate the extraction terminal at your earliest convenience.
One last mission. Let's make it count. Always hate this stuff. Hungry, hungry for ammo. Nothing to see here. Move along. This is how I feel after a hug.
perhaps trying harder would be a good idea. A vault terminal was deactivated. You have found a vault terminal. Good job. Vault terminal deactivated. You are natural. Is it me? Or is it getting longer? I'm a low-key grab this. Scratch this position. There is no vault terminal here. Get right in.
Mission. Let's make it count. 